in several compilations of Kinos that have been published recently, there are included Kinos about the Holocaust, two that are famously um, said are uh, Hazocher Maskirov uh, by Rav Schwab, Rav Shimon Schwab, and another by the Baba Verevi. Rav Shimon Schwab was born n near the beginning of the century, um, 1908, I believe, and passed away in 1995. He grew up in Germany, in uh, Frankfurt am Main, and was a member of the Kehila which was uh, led by Rav Breuer at the time, um, and which was uh, founded um, by Rav Sham Shunfal Hirsch, based on Rav Hirsch's famous uh, ideology of Torah im Derech Eretz. Rav Schwab attended uh, Tel's Yeshiva in Tel's, Europe, and also the Mir Yeshiva briefly and uh, became a Rav in Bavaria. And um, uh, shortly before the Holocaust was able to um, move at the invitation of uh, Rabbi Dr. Leo Young, I believe, uh, he, he moved to uh, Baltimore with his family. He was the Rav of what is commonly called the Ekeshishul in Baltimore on um, Glen Avenue, She'eris Yisrael, and then later was invited in the late 50s to be the Rav <clears throat> of the Breuer's community in Washington Heights, where he stayed until he passed away in 1995. Rav Shra was a very big Talmud Chacham, very learned, and very dedicated to the survival of the Jewish people. His feelings are reflected uh, profoundly in the kina that is included in um, the back of the kinos. It's noteworthy that the kina, as well as that of the Baba Verebis, um, is included in the newer versions of the Art Scroll kinos, as well as the Koran Kinos, and it may be in others as well. Rav Shrav's Kina describes in a fairly graphic detail the destruction that happened to individuals as well as communities during the Holocaust. As uh, uh, he mentions a Shlishia, Shlishia Levaer. One third to destruction, to burning. This described the fate of our people in the first half of the uh, 1940s. Um, in fact, um, Jimmy Carter met with Menachem Begin in 1977, and Menachem Begin, uh, I, I've read, said uh, that our people were tertiated and Carter didn't understand the word. In fact, it's not a formal word, but he said the word decimated means was something that the Romans used to do when there were people, a group of people that they were unhappy with, either for rebelling or some other reason. They would take, they would kill one out of ten, reflected in the uh, Desi, the ten or tenth. And Menachem Begin said, we were tertiated. The Nazis killed one third of our people. In addition, and the day of Tisha B'Av is actually quite appropriate to mourn the victims of the Holocaust. The uh, One of the things that Menachem Begin tried to do when he first became prime minister was to abolish a separate celebration of Yom HaShoah because he felt that we must understand the Holocaust as 
something that is in the continuation of the litany of horrors and suffering to which the nations of the world condemn the Jews. His efforts were not successful, and there is a separate marking of Holocaust remembrance. But Tisha B'Av is still an important day on which to remember the Holocaust, especially because there are fortunately still people among us who are survivors of that terrible time. And we have the opportunity to mourn together with them in some measure by the reading of these kinos. <laughs>